Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. We are going to be changing the lug nuts. 2013 Ford F-150 with the 5.0. <clears throat> okay. As you can see, we're, re we're replacing these lug nuts. And yes, you're probably sitting here thinking, what's wrong with them? Well, these lug nuts are fine, but we're going to keep these. We're going to show you what I mean. The last owners who had this truck had mismatching lug nuts there they were like different sizes these are the same size and then you come over here these lug nuts here are very dangerous you could tell they're shredded to shit you know one of them is a different size than the other ones the thread is not all that great took it to a tire place to get this tire put on they said this is going to tear up your rim the guy almost cut himself i forgot to tell the guy that i'm told the guy's going to replace them Same for this side. This side has good lug nuts, but it's missing one when I got it. But we're going to replace them all so we know they all have good threads. And we know that they're all the same exact size. The owner had four other ones that came with the truck. They said that they said that those were damaged. But when I looked at the old ones, they looked like they were better than these. And they said these were new. And these do not look like they're new. They are cut up to hell, so they must have ruined them after the bottom new but these these do not look like they're really new these look pretty old well we're gonna replace them i'm not jacking the truck up <clears throat> sorry excuse me and i'm not gonna sit here and take the whole tire off we're just gonna replace them one by one but we're not gonna show you all of them we're gonna do maybe one tire so y'all can get an example on how to do them if you don't know how to and the size of these lug nuts that are on the truck right now is a 7 8 half inch drive and where did i get these from y'all are wondering how, how why you how'd you get so many <clears throat> so i go on the old rallies or autozone or whatever for the original ones they're about 5.69 a piece for 20 because this is a six lug nut wheel so they take 24 i am not going to pay Five sixty nine piece for these, or even five twenty nine a piece for the half for the one for the half lug nuts, the one that has the hole in them. And you buy t only twenty of them, it's one hundred and ninety nine dollars. So I go online. This is from eBay. Got it within like a day, which is kind of incredible. Well, two days because the weekend. Um, I was actually impressed. I mean, they look good. They feel nice. They feel heavy, and. For the for thirty three dollars and sixty nine cent, you get all twenty four lug nuts, which is cheaper because you spend about what thirty three dollars just buying five lug nuts for one wheel. It's 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 crazy. So we're gonna take one off since I got one wheel already loose, and this is what the new lug nuts look like. You can tell they feel heavy, they feel durable. These are aftermarket. These are not made. These are not directly from Ford. And uh, let's see if it's still 7 8 uh, Yeah, it's still 7 8 It's just a teeny loose, but not as tight. Well, we're going to find out. <clears throat> and this is the back wheel. Take one off at a time. Now, I don't ever throw good car parts away. Sorry, that was my cat in the way. So, I know how it feels to junk stuff that don't need to be junk, especially when people are looking for them. I'm going to put it right there so I know where it's at. I guess my little friend wants to sit here and say hello. And we're going to put this one on to be sure everything's good. It's usually best to grease them up, but I greased these uh, studs up last week, so I'm not going to need to do them again. Because there's one. That one's on there. Now, these may have gotten tightened again. Okay. That was two. Let's see what happens. So far, they're fitting on the threads nice and snug. They're not slipping or anything like that, as you can tell. And these threads look really, really good on these on this hub. So I, at least the hubs weren't abused. 
and the truck's not rusted, just normal, normal, a little bit of normal rust from Florida. But that's basically about it. <clears throat> Take this one off. Put this one on. And I don't know if all these forts are six lug nut, but I thought they were five until I, until, until I got ready to order these. I was like, why are they selling me 24 of these? I said, it's a five lug nut wheel. And when I come out and looked at it, I was like, nope, it's a six lug nut. I was like, now there's no reason for me to not, oh, well, I was like, well, now I know why they're selling me 24. I was like, damn, I'm getting four extra lug nuts. I was wrong. I got four total there. Always good to keep them just in case you lose them or one of them breaks or something. Most tire shops don't even sell these anymore. They don't like them. They like the open open lug nut ones because they're easier and I guess the new cars just don't have them anymore because these pieces here, they just end up falling off and breaking off like the, like, like the ones on the front passenger did. But that could have either been due to customer fault slash previous owner and most of the time that happens they either happens for one they were the originals and they stripped them or two just old age the car that my wife drives is hhr and that damn thing all all almost like fire like all, like all the lug nuts mainly broke on that damn thing they had to rip them off because they were old this one i'm gonna have to loosen up again because it, it got tightened back up for some odd reason. I don't know what happened to my long half inch drive. Hold on one second, guys. This one is not. Uh. I guess that one, for some reason, is not the same size. Yeah, we're having a problem with that one. I'm gonna have to go get the, um, I'm gonna have to go get the tool. Well, I gotta figure out what other size it is, but I'm not gonna bore y'all with the details are trying to get the right size right at the moment as you can tell they're fitting like they should so that tells me that this one only had one wrong one different size five of them were the same size out of six And I didn't want to get the impact gun out because the one I have is 20 volt and it doesn't really take them off if they're tight. So I wasn't really going to waste my time, you know, with the BS. Okay, right, that one's tight. I use a torque wrench. Okay. Those are tight, and as you can see, that's what the new ones look like besides that one. But those are the new lug nuts for a Ford F-150. So, here's what they written. These are the old ones. Threads look really, really good comparing. I don't see anything shredded in there. No pieces missing. No, no like, pieces of metal hanging off of anything. I'll keep these. You never know. But this side here, I need to find out. Let's test. Let's see. Right size. That's right size. That's the right size. Let me check this one again. Right size. Yep. We're going around testing. So those that fits snug for this. 
7 8 socket. I'll be surprised. Actually, that one's smaller. Yeah, these are mismatch. As you can tell. Yeah. All these are the same size, but different size on a different tire. It's weird. They really didn't. They People just don't do stuff the right way anymore. These are the same size as the other side. These we already know. Okay. All right, folks. That's how you change the lug nuts on the 2013 Ford F-150. 18-inch tires. I would give you all the part number on this, but there's not one on this box. Might have been on the other box that it came in. Actually, no, it came in a wrap. So, I don't see a barcode. But I will leave the link in the in this, in this description on the video so you can find the same ones I do. So, you know you get the correct ones for your vehicle if you want it to look good. You know, totally up to you. Um, hope this video helps. And subscribe to our channel. And y'all have a great day. And drive safe out there.